Hey, today I wanted to show you how I figured out, well, with the help of people online, how to make a collider work such that it bounds the area that you want to play in so you don't go outside of that. Uh, what I was doing before is I had square levels and I made bounding volumes like this. And you can kind of see that there was some slant to them and then there was a straight part and I just hoped that they couldn't roll up above that and I could I suppose put a cap on the top but this was getting kind of cumbersome and it really didn't work very well for circles uh, I tried cutting off the corners with this but it was just more and more cumbersome all the time so I thought what if there was a way I could just make a sphere and have your player stuck inside it and there is a way so well i found it online i found it at this on this um this specific forum page post can you invert a sphere or box collider and down here roger lou suggested this and you put this code in one script add inverted mesh collider and this code in a different script and this one just goes anywhere in uh in, anywhere in your assets folder and then you attach this script to your object and there's not that much to it it removes the existing colliders if there are any it inverts the mesh so that on uh, instead of being instead of bumping into the outside of the mesh you bump into the inside of the mesh and then adds a new collider for that new mesh. So when you just copy and paste those things in as scripts, just like this, they're just in my scripts folder, that's all they are. Then create a new sphere and don't do anything more than add that script and then click this button, create inverted mesh collider. It removed the old mesh collider added this new mesh collider. It was a sphere collider before. Now, now this sphere is offset in the wrong position, so I'm going to reset the position. It's also very small, so I'm going to go 50, 50, and 50. Now you can see that that means it's inside the bounds of this particular play field. So I'm going to hit, I'm going to hit I'm going to go try to get to the edges, and you can't all the way around. So I thought that was pretty awesome, and it was really easy to do. So thank you to Roger Liu, and I'll see you guys next time.